UNCW men's soccer claimed its first title of the season, coming away with the championship at the Spring Hill Suites Classic following a 2 0 win over Winthrop at UNCW Soccer Stadium. Head coach Aiden Heaney joins us after the win, and coach, you have to be pleased. Two shutouts in three days, and you guys are 4 0 on the year. Uh, how did it look from your perspective? Yeah, we're delighted. Uh, you know, we wanted it was a goal of ours to win our home tournament, and uh, to do it with scoring five goals and, and not letting any, conceding any in, in two games, I think. Uh, Real testament to the, to the effort level that our players put in today, uh, especially today it was very, very hot and conditions were difficult and, and Winthrop made it difficult for us as well. So, uh, really pleased with how our, our players just had to dig in a little bit today. Once again, the offense put the pedal to the metal for 90 minutes, notched two goals, but it had several other very quality chances. You have to be pleased with the offensive production you guys are putting forth in the first four games of the season. Yeah, I, I am. I'm delighted. I, I, mainly because we're getting a number of guys scoring goals, just as not one. So I think it causes other teams a real problem. We uh, have to focus on not just one player. So again, we're sharing it. And uh, you know, no, I still think that's uh, going to continue to get better. So uh, yeah, it's very, very pleasing. Obviously, Julio Moncada and Stian uh, Sam Beckhog led the way offensively. Julio was named the tournament's offensive MVP. Those two are really starting to gel together up front for you. How important is it for you to have that chemistry as you go forward? Yeah, it's honestly, I mean, you could, you could, uh, you could look at all of our strikers today. I think they all played a part. Uh, Philip Good, you know, uh, I've got to make, make mention of him and Daniel as well because the effort level that those guys put in and the problems they created and open up some of the spaces for these guys too. So I think they really, you know, as a group, are, are really working to uh, to make some, some something happen for us in the attacking third of the field. And then defensively, Mark Lindstrom was named the tournament's defensive MVP. Ryan Creighton's anchored that effort all, all weekend. No sh goals allowed in two games. How important is it for you to have a solid defense this early in the season? Yeah, it's very important. And, and what happens ahead of the ball too, Eric? I think our, our guys are working from the front back and. Um, you know, we really limited the opportunities that, that Winthrop had. Um, so yeah, but the, you, you want to get the, the understanding down, and, and you can see that the guys are really kind of committed to, to not giving too much away. So it's uh, again, that, that's a very, very big piece of, of the puzzle for us. First two home wins out of the way. You head now back on the road to Florida Gulf Coast next week. Uh, what are you going to work on and, and prepare for the Eagles next Saturday? Yeah, we got to we got to re rebound and just get get a little bit of rest and re recovery and. Uh, you know, we played Florida Gulf Coast here last season, and they're a very, very talented team. So it's uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a place we're going to have to go and play extremely well to to get a result. But UNC, we'll be ready. UNCW now 4-0 on the season. Coach, congratulations on the outstanding weekend. Thanks for the time. Thank you.